All right, so I wasn't planning on going live today, uh, but I'm gonna come live because I've noticed something that is happening quite often and I've talked about it before, um, but I wanna do a live specifically to and about meditation. So everybody knows that meditation is a wonderful thing. If you are practicing meditation, it relaxes you, it, clears your emotion it there are so many positive benefits to meditation but nobody's talking about what can happen if you share meditation without warnings everything comes with a warning um so what is the warning of meditation so most of you may or may not realize that meditation is a form of hypnosis. Uh, not your stage hypnosis where you're clucking like a chicken, um, but meditation is a form of deep re relaxation, which is hypnosis. We learn about this as we become certified as past life regressionists. Um, we learn about it, it through hypnotherapy. Um, all of this, this is part of that deep relaxation, right? So when you're saying, when say you or a family member of yours has practiced meditation and it's gone great and you love it and it's done wonders for you and you say, hey, I've got this guided meditation I want to share with you and then you go and share it and I've actually had this happen. My best friend who suffers from panic and anxiety was given a guided meditation and said, oh, this is great. You know, it really helps you. It helps you to relax. It helps you to do so many other things. And while that is absolutely great, and I love that the person shared that with her, they did not tell her what can happen during meditation. When you are in a state of meditation, a state of hypnosis, there is the possibility that you are going to go into a trance. There is a possibility where you're going to have out-of-body experiences and there are possibilities that if you are a psychic intuitive medium empath whatever that you're going to take on outside energies such as you know communicating with your spirit guides or uh, communicating with the spirits of, of lost loved ones whatever that may be now if you're in the middle of a deep meditation and you go into that trance you could be rocking back and forth side to side um, you can feel as though you're going to faint or go to sleep. All of those are normal in a meditation. But if you don't know about them, what do you think is going to happen? Right? What do you think is going to happen? You're going to panic, right? You're going to think, oh, I'm not in control. Oh, I'm not, you know, um, you're in the middle of a meditation and everything's been great. And then all of a sudden, you start rocking back and forth your body starts tingling uh you feel like you're you know projecting out of your body whatever that may be that's going to create a lot more panic and anxiety and something that can greatly help and aid people in their journeys are now turned off of this because they've completely panicked over it right they've they've been given this ex this extreme case of panic and anxiety because nobody told them that during a meditation you can start rocking back and forth and tingling and astral projecting and all of these other things that can happen during meditation. People aren't warning other people. It's like having pot cupcakes. Honestly, it's like having pot brownies, giving them to somebody, telling them they're straight brownies. And then all of a sudden they have this absolutely terrible reaction to it because they're tripping out. Meditation can do the same thing. You think, oh, Melissa, you're, you're crazy to be correlating meditation and pot brownies, but it's not. If you're giving somebody something without the proper information or warnings, you can do a lot more harm to them than you can good. Think about that before you're sharing meditation. Always, always, if you're recording guided meditations, if you are teaching people about meditation, if you're a meditation guru, you should every time, if you've got 50 guided meditations, you should be having that warning pop up at the beginning of every guided meditation. People aren't gonna look back. People aren't gonna search for the warnings. They're going to think, oh, everybody's doing it. It's great. It's this new craze. Meditation is awesome. Meditation's been around for hundreds of thousands of years, but nobody talks about what can happen during a meditation. And then you completely panic and you don't want to meditate again. So you've just lost an amazing tool 
to use to calm yourself, calm your emotions, to relax your body, and get some of that internal guidance that you need. So think about it. You should always be putting that warning in your videos, in your messaging, anything to do with meditation. There should always be a warning that there are side effects to meditation that people don't talk about. And whether you're spiritual or not, it doesn't matter. Um, even if you're not spiritual and if you're not spiritual, you're not li looking to learn about your spiritual gifts and abilities. And all of a sudden you start feeling like you're in a trance. What's going to happen? You're going to panic and then you're going to think you're not in control. When you are meditating, you are always and constantly in control. If that happens, remember that you are in control and take it as an adventure. Much love, guys. Hope you share this message.